Hi, second graders. Welcome to your math lesson for today. You are going to be needing a dry erase board and a dry erase marker. So go ahead and go grab that before we start our lesson. And press pause if you need to, and then come back to me. All right, so now that you're back with me, we are going to practice writing our numbers using pictures today. But before we do that, I'm going to show you there's so many different ways we can show our number using place value. I'm going to show you the number 246. So on our hundreds, tens, and ones chart, I, I've shown you 246 broken down to two hundreds, four tens, and six ones. I've also shown it bundled up. These are little popsicle sticks here. So we have grouped up by hundreds. This is a group of hundred right here. So we have two hundreds, four groups of 10, and then we have six ones here. So there's 100, 200, and then 10, 20, 30, 40, and then our six ones over there. And I'm going to show you down here before I show you our last way. We have our base 10 blocks. There's two hundreds for 200, our 10, 20, 30, 40 for our tens place, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, our six cubes for our ones place. Now, the, the way I wanted to show you today was with pictures. And I think I've showed you this before in one of our work worksheets. It was called Quick Tens and Quick Ones, where today we're going to add our hundreds. So you can show that by making a little square for our hundreds place, and it looks just like our flats. And you can see that our one or our tens, sorry, look like our french fries. And then our little dots kind of look like our cubes, too. So if you start at our hundreds, we have two for our hundreds, and then we have four for our tens place, and then one, two, three, four, five, and six for our ones place. I have a whole bunch down here that I am going to show you for our pictures. So we're gonna start with the number 107. So in our hundreds place, we're going to have a one. In our tens place, we have a zero. And then in our ones place, we have a seven. So if I'm going to show that with pictures, it would be one, hundred. Do I have any in the tens place? Nope, so I'm not going to make any quick tens. And then I'm going to put one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that shows 100 and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 107. Okay, for the next one, we have 357. So three in the hundreds place, five in the tens place, and a seven in the ones place. So we need to make three hundreds. One, two, three, and then I'm going to make five tens. One, two, three, four, five, and then seven ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And our last one on here is 438. So I need to make, let me pull this a little closer so you can see, Oh, let's put it in our hundreds place first. Four hundreds, three tens, and eight ones. And then I'm going to do my picture. So four hundreds would look like this. One, two, three, four. And then my tens. One, two, three. And my ones. How many are you going to make? Eight. One, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's just one more way to show your place value. We're going to do pictures. So now I would like for you to grab your dry erase board and we're going to practice them together. So the first one I want you to do is the number 200 and 
52. Okay, so write that on your board, and I want you to go ahead and try it on your own. You are going to make the square for your hundreds, the lines for your tens, and the little dots for your ones. So go ahead and try that on your own, and then I'm going to show you the answer. You go ahead and do that while you're working on yours. You ready for the answer? All right, yours should look like this. There's one, two for your hundreds, and then one, two, three, four, five for your tens, and then one, two for your ones place. Okay, let's try another one. Your next one I want you to do is the number 38. All right, 38, give that a try. 38. Ready for the answer? Is that what you got? Do we have any hundreds for this one? Nope, there's nothing in the hundreds place. So you're gonna start with your quick tens. 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 38. All right, friends, your next number is going to be 404. Four, zero, four. Give it a try. 404. You ready, friends? Is that what yours looks like? You're going to start with your hundreds place. So you need four of these squares, 100, 200, 300, 400. Do we have anything in our tens place? That's a zero. So we have 400, 401, 402, 403, 404. Let's try one more. Your number is 173. 173, that's one, seven, three. All right, give it a try. All right, time's up. Is this what your board looks like? Yeah, good job. All right, we're gonna start with the hundreds place. We have a one. So you're gonna have a one square for your hundreds place. So there's 100 there. And then in your tens place, we have a seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then your ones place, we have a three. One, two, three. So if you would like to challenge yourself and keep trying, go to your math folder and pull out your number book to a thousand and keep finding numbers. You can go all the way to a thousand if you want to and keep practicing on your board. When you're finished, go ahead and get out your paper for today and you're gonna practice the same thing we did on our board. And don't forget to put your numbers in your hundreds, tens, and ones chart. And then you are going to have some subtraction practice. This is going to be easy for you. You're going to practice with your number line. So use that if you need help. If not, you can just use your brain. All right, friends, have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow.